What's going on everybody? Welcome to G Myers World and this is part of the G Myers World Legends franchise. If you're interested in joining the franchise, uh, getting on the waiting list, you'd want to contact at VY Electrify on Twitter to be added to the waiting list. Um, today we're going to be taking on the Detroit Lions. This is a whole new um, a whole new series. Pretty much we had the old franchise and now we started a new one with Legends. So this is all starting from the bottom. Uh, everybody get, they, they were able to pick one Legend player. My Legend player is Plaxico Barris. I think the guy, uh, this guy Jeffrey Brown by the play, he has Patrick Willis because in the game you're going to see that Patrick Willis is going to be exiting the game with an injury. Uh, so for everybody that's in the franchise, the reason I'm putting this video out is to let you guys understand something. Um, the Madden 17 is total garbage. It's not something that, um, I have an issue saying, I've been saying it for a very, very long time. It's just the fact that when they continue to patch the game and make it worse, it's something that something has to be done because the game is, it has a lot of potential. Um, yeah, I know it's going to be a lot of guys that are probably new to the channel. Um, that's going to say, yeah, but you know, the same, the same old question, if you hate it so much, why do you play it? Um, I'm not going to answer that. I'm going to just hopefully you. Uh, okay, first of all, let me. I'm not, I'm not going to say anything bad about the people that are going to ask that question. That was Hackenberg. Um, this is what I'm going to recommend to you guys. Don't ever take advice from VY Electrify when it comes to franchise. He's a complete idiot. He told me to start Hackenberg, but that's not even the point, bro. You know what I'm saying? Um, the, the bottom line is I, me throwing that pick has nothing to do with my complaints because I outright threw the pick. Uh, did I just say pick? The pick. I chose to start Hackenberg. That dude is straight buns. He's straight garbage. I know that he's garbage. I still started him instead of Jay Cutler. That's my fault. I'm not worried about that pick. I, I deserve to throw that pick. That has nothing to do with why I hate this game. I'm going to take you through, as the game progresses, why I hate this game. First of all, um, I'm going to go ahead and block his field goal. That one was for VY Electrify, just so that he knows that it's nothing personal with him. I'm going to block your field goal just to block it. All right? So that's Hackenberg again. He's going to overthrow the ball, right? So I'm going to take out Hackenberg on this play. I got to get rid of the dude is garbage. We're going to take Hackenberg out, and we're going to put in Jay Cutler, right? I don't know if this guy thought that I paused the game because, you know, like a lot of fuck boys, they pause the game after some BS that they think that EA gives them. So they pause the game a lot. This guy turned out to be... Like a guy, like, right, I get this catch, right? So he's going to start pausing the game. He paused the game earlier or something. Like, I told you guys, any if you go to a stream and a guy pauses the game or you know of a player that does that after plays what that happened in Madden 17, they should you shouldn't respect them because the game should just always be paused because the game itself is a joke. So you shouldn't even play it. You see what I'm saying? Like, if you're pausing the game for BS because, of, yeah, 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 whatever, bro. This dude, Jay Cutler, straight garbage. If you just look at the logic, if you pause the game because you think a game that's straight butt cheeks gave you BS, you, look look at it, look at this shit, bro. Look at what's going on. But he wasn't pausing the game for anything else, and that's why I said to myself, I'm like, yo, you know what? It's a lot of guys that play this game that really think that they're good over the last two years, and th that's the that's the biggest issue that I have with the game because you don't get there's no benefit to making a good read if you're a decent player. There's no benefit to it. What's gonna happen is. It, it, it's just gonna be something stupid. It's gonna be real, real stupid. Like, I, I don't even know what that was. I should have been going back for six. But it does, if you make a great defensive play, if you do something that makes sense, you won't, it, there's no benefit for it. So more likely than not, I had to adjust my my, my entire game to just not giving a F. I, yo, it, it, this game is so wild and venomous, bro. I'm going to tell you, but look, let's not even get to that right now. Right now, I'm going to score a touchdown. Look at what's going to happen. I'm going to kick this field goal. Look at where my circle is. You see the circle is behind the upright? I missed that kick, but it looked like it went right through. I don't you, you I don't know exactly what goes on at the EA Sports Laboratory. It has to be a laboratory. It can't be a real office of work because it, it just has to be continuous experimentation. It doesn't make sense. Right there, I already knew that he's gonna score on that right there out of the jumbo heavy. These dudes run around with customs bigger than encyclopedias. You know what I'm saying? I, I can't do all that custom stuff. Like it's, it, it's just stupid to me because I play a lot of mutt, so I don't really care about custom playbooks. And it's nothing against guys that use customs. It's just like when your custom is that big, like, are you serious right now? Like, are you a scientist trying to create a potion? Like, why is your custom that big though? Like this dude is really running around with a custom playbook. And not only that, he's pausing the game after. So that was Patrick Willis, right? He got smashed up. Like after that play, you saw that he tried to take it. Yo, Jordan Howard is a goon. All right, so this guy proceeds to pause the game again. I actually let it wait the whole 30 seconds because, like, from this point forward, like, this guy's a joke. You know what I'm saying? Like, I don't, it isn't, he's in my division, I guess, because what is he? He's the Lions. Yeah, so, you know, I'll play him, I'll play him more, but yeah, pa Patrick Willis is out just for anybody else that has to play him. And of course, Plaxico's going to drop the ball. But 
immediately, once you're a guy that pauses the game, I lose all respect for you. You're a joke. And then not only that, you you, you got to see, like, look, why are they, why are they playing racquetball and tennis? Bro, volleyball, all kinds of sports other than football. Look, yo, look, just throw the doubt with my safety right there, man. Throw the doubt with my safety standing in. It doesn't really matter. Yeah, I'm going for a swat. Don't matter. Just do whatever you got to do. But look, it's going to get really, really interesting right now because plays like this that decide the game. Look, all right, that's a pick. But it's not, though. It's an alley-oop to him. You see, those type of deciding plays, those are the plays that make this game really, really bad. Like, okay, he gets an overthrow right there. Bro, that's just EA showing him, like, bro, it should have been a pick before, but he throws another pick. But it's not a pick. But, they, but they're patching it, though. They're patching these things. They're patching wide-open rack drops. They're patching these things. But nothing is getting patched. The only thing that's getting patched into the game is invisible linemen and people just coming in off vicious B-gaps and A-gaps since the last patch. I don't, if you can't get it right, like, bro, what is he, why is he reaching his arm out like that? That's 6'6", six, six Leonard Floyd. At this point, I'm just like, I'm just so done with the game. So, like, I look, guys, we're just do we're just playing this franchise to wind down the time. There's a lot of guys that like to play the franchise, to have fun and do stuff like that. That is, that is the only reason that I'm playing this. I do not enjoy this game at all. I hate this game completely. Um, right there, I just played the wrong defense. I was blitzing the wrong guy, and that's why he's wide open. But everybody knows these plays. You know, he probably stays on YouTube jerking his cock 24 hours a day. It doesn't really matter about that. I'm not concerned about all those plays. Like, I wasn't even really focused on what was going on within the game at this point. So I'm just being honest with you. And the guys that watch me stream um, live at G Myers World, you can go there right now and follow me at G Myers World. You guys know, like, it's not, this, this, I can't take this game seriously. I don't know why I got caught on my lineman right there. There's, there is no way, there is no logical person even the competitors that can possibly take this game seriously, even if you're really, really good, you have to say to yourself, there is no way possible that this game can be this bad and be available worldwide for consumption. It, you have to, that right there, he lurked me. That was probably his only good play of the game where I had to say, all right, you know, good lurk or whatever like that. Other than that, the dude is a straight bum. I don't care, like, bro, look, listen. When I say bum, you say more. Like, I don't know about why I just said that, it just came to me. But look, Cutler can't throw the, um. He can't throw the ball. And I don't know if it was so windy that that's why he was overthrowing every pass, but it's something I'm going to have to deal with with Jay Cutler. I'm going to have to try to make a trade or something like that. If you guys are in the franchise, hit me up. Let me know what, what you know what I'm saying, what the deal is. I got to get rid of this guy. This guy is really, really bad. He's really, really fucking bad. Um, Jay Cutler and Hackenberg. I really, I have nobody to throw the ball with. So it's going to be an uphill battle until I can get somebody that can, um, you know, deliver passes on point. It's going to be very, very difficult. Um, right here, I'm gonna get an animation like an OBJ, but he catch. I, I don't. I don't know, man. I, I. I'm really, really concerned to know if they. Oh, okay. Well, I don't know what just happened. He just wiggled his body and just caught that catch. I'm really, really concerned to know if they get excitement. Like, what the hell was that? Why did he pause the game with that? He should have paused it. He should have paused it and jerked his dick or something. Because this guy's a freaking jerk off. But all I'm saying is this: I can't, with a with a rational mind not be honest about this game at any time I, you know what i'm saying like the guys that act like this game is good it's gonna years are gonna go by bro but they're gonna die a little inside bro like you can't it you can't ignore the fact that these things happen you know what i'm saying you can't when you have a voice and you're able to say it like with to when to was saying whatever and then the ea okay yeah drop the ball and then ea went after to or whatever was going on and all the other bs that was happening you, you, it just doesn't make any sense. Yeah, I threw that right there. He was blitzing everybody. I just threw it up. It doesn't really matter, bro. The game was over. He, he blitzed everybody, and I just threw the ball to anybody. It didn't matter to me right there. Um, so just be, yo, to be, to be completely honest with you, bro, I, I was completely, I checked out. You know what I'm saying? Dude came out, started doing whatever he wanted. After I missed that, the extra point, I already knew pretty much EA was going to show me what time it was, bro, with no lube, because the circle was clearly behind the upright, and I just couldn't get it. So it is what it is. I just wanted to give you guys insight into it, because I know a lot of you guys in the franchise want to see uh, some of the games. I didn't show the last win that I had with KCABS, but I showed how I got the win during one of my live streams. If you guys want to go to look at, you know, the past broadcast on Twitch, I'm going to see you guys next time, man. Enjoy Madden 17. One love.